in this presentation I am going to discuss about a minus b whole cube which equals to a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square minus b cube using cubical block here I have a cube whose side is a that is this total length is a and its height and breadth is a so volume of this total cube is equals to a cube and let's suppose that this distance is b this distance is b then the remaining distance of is from here to here this part is a minus b and here also same thing suppose this part is b then out of a if this part is b then the remaining distance is a minus b so it's clear that the edge of cube is a and which is divided into two parts out of those one part which is a bit longer is supposed as b then remaining part will be clearly a minus b now let's continue calculating a minus b whole cube according to our assumption a minus b whole cube is this cube which is here I'm going to separate it this is a minus b whole cube because its each side is a minus b length a minus b breadth a minus b and height also a minus b so its volume is equal to a minus b whole cube but it must be equal to volume of total cube minus volume of remaining blocks by calculating volume of each of the blocks let's separate this cube and calculate volume of each of the parts here volume of this block is this distance b this distance a minus b and this distance or this length a minus b so its volume is b times a minus b whole square length times breadth times height similarly volume of this block let's check once volume of this block also same b times a minus b whole square so we got two blocks of same size b times a minus b whole square and there is one more block which is in this bottom part it's here whose volume is v times a minus b whole square so we got all together three blocks having volume b times a minus b whole square so I'll collect them together in same place so that it will be easy to understand next let's consider this block whose dimensions are b times b times a minus b so volume of this block is b square times a minus b let's collect other blocks of same volume here this is one of the blocks whose volume is b square times a minus b and here is one more block having same volume and one more here so these three blocks are such that their volume is equals to b square times a minus b these are the three blocks which are here their volume equals to b square times a minus b. so total volume equals to 3 times of b square times a minus b now one more block is remaining which is cube having length b breadth b and height also b so its volume is b cube then the identity can be established in this way a minus b whole cube that is volume of this block 
is equals to a cube that is total volume total volume of cuboid you see here this is a cube total minus there are three blocks having volume b square times a minus b and another three blocks having volume v times a minus b whole square and one block having volume b cube so if we subtract this much quantities or volumes from volume of the cube which is here then we get volume of the small cube having dimension a minus b that is will get a minus b whole cube so let's simplify this here a cube as it is minus 3b square multiplied by a is equals to 3ab square minus minus plus 3b square times b is equals to 3b cube again here minus 3b times a minus b whole square that is equals to a square minus 2ab plus b square minus this b cube as it is so it's equals to a cube minus 3ab square plus 3b cube minus 3b times a square is equals to 3a square b again minus minus plus 3 times 2 equals to 6 and ab times b equals to ab square again minus plus minus 3b times b square it's 3b cube and minus b cube as it is plus 3b cube and minus 3b cube we can cancel a cube minus b cube and here minus 3ab square and plus 6ab square these are like terms so its value is plus 3ab square next there is one more term minus 3a square b which equals to a cube minus this term which is 3a square b plus this term which is 3a b square and finally this term which is minus b cube which is required formula of a minus b whole cube hence we write a minus b whole cube equals to a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube if we write in this way a cube minus b cube together and taking common from these middle two terms then there will be minus 3ab common so after taking minus 3ab common here a lift and minus plus minus here b so a minus b whole cube can be written as one way is a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube and another way to represent the same formula is a cube minus b cube minus 3ab times a minus b so students i hope you understood a minus b whole cube equals to a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube or a minus b whole cube equals to a cube minus b cube minus 3ab times a minus b so while using this formula just remember that the values of a b or a minus b which are used here are supposed as dimension of cube or cuboid thank you